history of this world is written up, prayer will be written up as a weapon that is stronger than tanks, greater than bombs, and more powerful than armies. It is October 1984. The communist government of East Germany is led by the dictator Erich Honecker. And in 1984, October, Christian Führer, a, a, method, a Lutheran pastor in Leipzig, Germany, gathered together a group to pray. And there were, the group was small at first, maybe 40 or 50, and they met in the Lutheran church in Leipzig, and they began to kneel and pray. And they prayed for the outpouring of the Holy Spirit. They prayed that God would move upon the political leaders of that nation. They prayed for freedom. They prayed that the Berlin Wall would come down. They prayed in 1984 and 1985 and 1986 and 1987. They actually prayed for five years, but the groups grew larger. The Leipzig group was joined by a group in Dresden. That was joined by a group in East Berlin. The night the Berlin Wall fell, it's estimated that a million people were praying throughout East Germany that God would move powerfully. Something happens when God's people pray. Something happens in Adventist churches when groups of two or three meet together to pray. All revival begins first when people are on their knees pleading with God for the outpouring of the Holy Spirit. All revival begins when people are interceding.